Rosetown mourns the passing of female whose life was snuffed out on no movement day. How you getting welcome? This is Links of Blur 7 TV News Report and we'll be right back with the details to come. Welcome to Links of Blur 7 TV News Report, providing you with the best in local and international news updates. This is a place where you can get the most reliable and informative news information. Links of Blur 7 TV News Report. Welcome back and thanks for joining us. This is Link Sabler 7 TV News Report. The community of Unity Lane in Rosetown, Kingston 13 was plunged into mourning on Sunday morning during the No Movement Day after Paula Raphael, a female from the community, was shot dead. Raphael, who celebrated her 56th birthday on August the 6th, was planning to get baptized but delayed this due to the rapid number of COVID cases currently on the island. According to a report from the Denham Town Police, about 11.15 a.m., Raphael, a shopkeeper, was sweeping her yard when she was approached by a gunman who opened fire, hitting her several times. The police were summoned and the woman taken to the hospital where she was pronounced dead. The gunman made Goody's escape in the area before the police arrived. This has left attention in the air as many are fearing for a reprisal to come based on this latest homicide in the Kingston 13 era. The police are continuing their investigation and has not so far ascertained a motive behind this latest homicide. Raphael Dead came just hours after gunman invaded a house on Bentley Avenue also in Rose Stone and shot and killed 51 year old Courtney Kelly. Three other persons were also injured in that attack. Murders in Jamaica have increased nearly 10% this year when compared to the corresponding period last year. As of August 21, the police recorded 912, which is 80 more than the 832 recorded over the corresponding period last year. This has been Link 7 TV News Report. Thanks for watching.